the Hollywood cinema has encountered huge changes with the help of advanced technologies since the 19th. Here, two films shot at two different era which aim at demonstrating it. The first selected film is titled Batman, released in 1966, starred by Adam West, and the other is titled The Dark Knight, released in 2008, featured by Bruce Wayne. Both are superhero films, but the other version of Batman were inspired by the DC Comics. While the newer version was inspired by the Joker's comic book in 1940, the 1988 graphic novel The Killing Joke, and the 1996 series The Long Halloween, the story remains approximately the same. Batman has to save the Gotham City from Joker. But however, the older version is more likely to be a comedy an action movie, while The Dark Knight is a science fiction drama, action and adventure, and fantasy one, thus more entertaining. There is a huge difference in their costume. In the movie in 1966, Batman's costume is very simple and colorful. Adam West even said that the costume was a complete disaster and uncomfortable. Why in the Dark Knight the costume is justified to be more believable to the real world? Designers even suggested a more sophisticated technology. The older version was in the context of American popular culture and Batman symbolizes everything the public hate about politicians. The newer versions deal with political landscape where questions of war and security were constantly at the forefront. Batman in 1966 had a huge influence on the cinema industries since it was the debut of Batman in color. It reflects the comic book environment and is a very affectionate parody on the contemporary mid-1960 culture. While The Dark Knight had influenced how the public views the mythos of Batman and Joker. And the last important topic to be tackled is the shooting of both films. In Batman 1966, the rap shot was used, and pictures of the set had colored maids instead of neutral maids, just like in comic strips. In the newer version, more sophisticated cameras were used. Even the IMAX and this MM were utilized, providing more new challenges for the filmmakers. The director Christopher Nolan wanted the film to be done in real and look for stuntmen. The bad part, only one stuntman could ride it. And also many special effects were used in the Dark Knight while known in the older version. The older version. The older version.